My name is Layla Britt, and I hoop. When younger girls see me play, I want them to see me as someone who never gives up, always tries their hardest, puts everything on the court, be a team player, be a leader for that one goal, which is to win. I've been playing for seven years and I kind of started playing because it just runs in my family. So a lot of people played, my mom, my grandpa, my dad. And I just, when I first started playing, I just fell in love with the game and I wanted to elevate every single day and I just wanted to get better. My mom played in high school. She's just always been my role model when it comes to basketball. The way she would play, she would have so much confidence in every shot she took. She would drive to the basket with so much confidence and that's just how I want to play. And having my stepdad as a coach, it can be frustrating sometimes, but I know he just wants me to be the best basketball player that I can be, and it's helped me a lot ever since I started playing. And he's very passionate about women's basketball, and he thinks we deserve more recognition, and he's done everything he can to make sure that I'm out there and that I can elevate my game anywhere I go. One of my goals is to be able to play in college and then hopefully one day go pro, just like um, Candace Parker, she plays in the WNBA. And I'm really inspired by her. She's one of my role models and she's one of the people that made me want to start playing basketball to begin with and I want to play just like her. Over the summer, I would be in the gym every day. I would practice with the boys from 6.30 to 7.30 sometimes and then I would practice with my team from 7.30 to 8.30. So I would be in the gym all the time knowing I wanted to get better because I, I had a goal in mind and I want to reach that goal. Last season, I won the season MVP, but it was like a bittersweet moment because we had just lost the championship, so it was hard to receive the award with a smile, but I was really grateful, and it was a really nice gift from the CBO. I wouldn't have been able to do it without my teammates. Like They were always there in every single game throughout the whole season, support me through every game, and they were always there for me. Being a part of the OW Snipers, it's a it's a really great opportunity. We're a really like a great team. Everyone on the team is so supportive of everyone, and we're kind of a new team because we hadn't had a girls team before, so we just started a girls team last year. But we all clicked right away, and now you can see it on the court sometimes. This season, uh, we want to come back, and we want to play more together as a team, and we want to win the championship this year. This year, with us being a part of the WCBL, we're super grateful, and I think it's a really great opportunity for my team and all of the other girls and all the other teams in this league to get more recognition that women deserve, because we just want to do the sport that we love and be able to get somewhere with it, and the WCBL helps us with that. Just as I act as a leader for the OW Snipers, my brother, who's younger, he plays on the younger boys team, the U14, he acts as a leader for them. And I feel like he looks up to me when it comes to basketball. He started playing because of me. So I feel like I'm one of his role models and I just wanna like put it out on the court so that he sees that I don't give up so he can play the exact same way. When younger girls see me play, I want them to see me as someone who never gives up, always tries their hardest, puts everything on the court, be a team player, be a leader for that one goal, which is to win. And I wanna be that role model for them. And I really wanna thank my parents because through everything, they've always been there for me. They've pushed me to, to be the best basketball player that I can be and just a, be the best like woman I can be in society today. And they've taught me so much and I know they want me to be successful and I know they're gonna help me get there. But without them, I wouldn't be here at all today. So I wanna thank them.